we are doing fourth chapter that is diversity in living organisms the topics like biological diversity groups and subgroups need for classifications and what is the basis of classifications that uh, all are the topics which we have done already then come forward to the topic that is mega diversity as we know mega means huge quantity and diversity means changes or varieties here we take meaning from mega as a huge number and uh, diversity as changes found among the organisms as given here beta there is uh, 1.7 to 1.8 million species which are discovered till and all these species have few to much changes to each other so there is a need of uh, a system to classify all these species that's why we use hierarchy of classifications in this hierarchy we divide all the species in different groups as given here kingdom phylum class order family genus and the last one is species so students let's start from the first group that is kingdom as given here it is the highest taxonomic character or category or we can say group now listen carefully beta now in kingdom we broadly broadly categorize all the living organisms in five groups uh, as given here monera protista fungi plantae and animalia uh, 